Hello, my name's Annie Lee. And my name's Callum Skinner. Welcome to the fourth broadcast of the Rutherford Report. Everyone here at the broadcast team hope that you have had a good start to the new year. We start off this report with a look into the Boys Dance Company. I'm here at Boys Dance Company, which happens every Wednesday in the drama studio. I'm here to find out more about what happens in this club. Let's go. We have some various numbers of boys, um, usually about 10, um, which has grown considerably since last year. You know, boys getting in together, a bit of dancing, a bit of here and there, you know, having fun. It's mainly about fun, but we do work hard, you know, everyone works hard together. It's a good opportunity for us to, like, dance. All different year groups, all working together, partly my choreography, partly their choreography. Um, the older ones mentor the younger ones to create performance pieces. Um, hopefully we might move on to doing performances and competitions in the future. And if you want to find out more about what happens to the Boys Dance Company, then contact Mrs Taylor. Thank you Anushka. This month's main news includes the options for you evening that supported the Year 9s in their GCC option choices. Year 11s also took the chance to find out more about the A-level courses available. The evening went incredibly well with many students now much more informed about the future options. The events included various subjects giving talks and information about their courses. Also, numerous companies attended including the NHS, Royal Marines, Bedfordshire Police and Network Rail. Thank you for all staff, students and parents who attended. Next, we have sports news with Ethan. Thanks guys. This month, we've had lots of sports fixes take place throughout the school. First of all, sixth form basketball played a tough game against Bedford Free School but came up victorious with 59-38 win. On the 27th, the Year 7 basketball team played against Lincroft and Bidnam, scoring 4-8 to eight in the first match. Year 11 rugby team played against Bidnam Sports College and turned out for an amazing win of 44-5. Under 15 girls, District Netball League won their first game with a score of 8-0. Their second game was unfortunately lost to Stratton with a score of 8-9. District Cross Country results, the Tyre Wilson won the Year 8-9 girls race and Maisie Reynoldson in Year 10 won the Year 10 to 11 race. And Year 7 football beat St Thomas More with a score of 5 to 3. Remember, if you want to join any of these clubs and many more, speak to a sports teacher or look at the club boards. Daisy will be here with the details in a minute. Back to you guys. Thank you, Ethan. On to other news, Tutor Groups recently took part in activities related to Internet Safety Day. This was to increase the awareness of the positives and dangers of the Internet. Tutor groups were asked to provide comments on what they liked about the internet. This included social media, Wikipedia, games and YouTube. I'm sure YouTube was a popular one since our broadcasts are now on YouTube. On to other news, a young enterprise group did well selling their fitness planners, shopping lists and to-do lists in Milton Keynes last month. They competed against 58 other schools and were congratulated for their originality and quality of their products and received a few sales. They have also had external businesses interested in their product. Well done to, to them. Now, we have an update on Mark Rutherford's vocal group. I'm here at Mark Rutherford Vocal Group to see them preparing for their next competition. We like singing an ensemble uh, with all the different ear groups. Yeah, just get to know people. Uh, yeah, we've got the Bedford Music Festival coming up. Um, we're there for the big vocal group and the sitform vocal group as well. We've got vocal group on a Thursday tutor time and anyone can come along and join that. We've also got a sixth form vocal group on Wednesdays, so come along. If you want to find out more about Vocal Group, then listen to the club news which is up next with Daisy. Thank you Anushka. Now if you wish to get involved in any clubs, including Vocal Group, listen now to Daisy as she updates us. Hi, welcome to Club News at the Rutherford Report. A cappella group meet every Wednesday during tutor time in the st drama studio. Music Theory Club for Year 10 is every Wednesday at lunchtime in B5. All years mix hockey is on Wednesdays after school on the sports field. Year 7 and 8 dodgeball is in the activities on Fridays after school 
We also have music technology club starting very soon. If you are interested, please see Miss Jones. Back to you guys. Thank you, Daisy. Lastly, if you're interested in getting involved in the BBC School Support, where you will get the chance to make new supports just like this one, please contact Mr Kirkwood in 017. Thank you for watching. This has been the Rutherford Report. We will see you again next month. Goodbye. Goodbye.